A Canton man says he and his pastor found his mother alone face down in a pillow with nobody nearby to help. She was getting treatment at a local nursing home. The two snapped these pictures, which have now gone viral, hoping to encourage others to hold their loved ones a little bit closer. Tonight, the nursing home is responding to their complaint as the family looks for answers about how this happened. News 5's Taylor DeHayes brings us the story tonight from Canton. Help me, help me. Crying for someone to help her in a place where it's expected, all hours, never leaving his mother's side. All day, night and day. James Brown found his mother at Alter Care Nobles Pond like this. Mom, mom, you know, and then she pulled the cover, her cover off her head. Not even recognizable. We couldn't tell that it was a human. I thought it was a cat that they had brought in because I kept saying, what is that over there? The family's pastor, Julia Wiggins, says the two spent 10 minutes searching for a nurse. The length of time that we spent banging, screaming, looking for assistance, she never came. 80 year old Esther Brown has been at Nobles Pond for just over a week, there for rehabilitation after a stay in the hospital to help her learn to walk again. Only days into her stay and Wiggins took this photo, showing Brown slumped over and left alone. I was devastated because I, I don't have a mother. She's like my mom also. So I was I was really devastated, um, almost out of um, character because it's like I was looking at my mom. You're thinking that you put her in a place of safety. The family filed a complaint with the nursing home immediately. News 5 reached out to Nobles Pond for answers. According to a statement from the nursing home, Brown is comfortable and safe. A spokesperson says they immediately reported the complaint to the Ohio Department of Health. They were on site Thursday and Friday and found the complaint to be unsubstantiated. The Akron District Office of the Ohio Department of Health is now reviewing their report. Taking a look at the facility on Medicare.gov, gold stars across the board. Still, Brown says families must do their due diligence. Just go visit your people. Stay aware of what's going on. Go visit your family. The family has decided to keep her in the home through the duration they've paid for. Until then, it's constant love. I hug her and I kiss her. I make sure I have lipstick on because I like to leave my lips on her so that she knows that um, she has someone that really loves her. I sing with her all the time. And high hopes. She's going to get through because I'm going to get through. God going to get us through. Well, we coming through. Brown's mother is staying here for one more week, and until then, Brown says he's not leaving his mother's side, praying she'll be home for good in a few days. In Canton, Taylor DeHayes, News 5.